Well, as the very term chief academic officer implies, the job of the provost or dean is to provide academic leadership. And if that's true, then certainly there are a number of very important ways in which a provost can have an impact on education for sustainability. The most immediate one, I would say, maybe the most direct way, is a provost can articulate sustainability education as a fundamental goal of the institution. Provosts play a big role, typically, in drafting mission statements, in drafting strategic plans, in doing self-studies for accreditation, in producing the documents that reflect what an institution thinks of itself, what its goals are. I'll give you a very specific example from Dickinson. This is something that um, we did in uh, 2011, a year ago. Uh, our diplomas had always been in Latin. And for reasons that are not connected to sustainability, we decided that we were going to translate them and do them in English instead. An idea actually uh, suggested by our own classics department. Well, translating diplomas from Latin into English gave us a chance to actually look at the wording and to change it. And we did in one very fundamental way. The old Latin version told the students who were graduating that they now had rights and privileges, those were the terms, rights and privileges as a consequence of earning their bachelor's degrees. The new English version tells them that they have rights and privileges and responsibilities. And the responsibilities are defined as responsibility to their communities, to their alma mater, and to their planetary home. Our students, each, each student has his or her own uh, carbon footprint, but we educate them to go out and be citizens and leaders. We educate them to go out and really have the potential to transform their own communities. And every time a student comes into contact with someone else, the many people that they come into contact with over the course of a lifetime, they have the potential for rippling out what we teach them.